By April 1964, IBM executives must have had their hearts in their mouths. The launch of IBM's System 360 was a $5 billion throw of the dice, a gamble on new technology that crammed ultimately as many as 70 semiconductor devices on a single half-inch ceramic square. These modules weren't yet chips as we've come to know them, but they were every bit as sophisticated as new integrated logic devices from Texas Instruments. They were also many times more dense and as much as 10 times more reliable than the discrete transistor modules that they replaced. Solid logic technology made IBM's computers smaller, faster and cooler than their predecessors and competitors. In 1966, two years before Intel was founded, IBM had become the semiconductor industry champion, making more than 90 million semiconductor devices that year.